have you had a conversation with your mum about how her anxiety causes you to get more worried about it? Um, I've had like one that was like heated, <laughs> but that was just before <laughs> I was that, going but out. But was that more was reactive? Like because yeah. she was putting pressure on you and you were getting frustrated and then it kind of... Yeah. So what I think would be really helpful to do is to pick your moment carefully, like find yeah. the moment that she's calm and you feel calm and just say something like, mum, I really appreciate how much you care for me mm. and you want me to be safe. And it's a really wonderful, lovely thing. And I notice sometimes the way that you do it causes a lot of stress when that doesn't 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 need to be and yeah. what my commitment to you is that i will do abc so when i'm traveling home i'll tell you when i'm going to leave and i'll share my uber but as long as i do that it'd be really helpful to me if you could not keep on kind of yeah. you know kind of sharing your anxieties and concerns yeah and just how, how do you think she i don't know your mom so yeah. but how do you think she would respond if you communicated um, in that way i think yeah i think she would understand it more definitely um and might yeah because uh, where it comes from of course is that she loves you she cares about yeah. you and she wants to keep you safe yeah that's what she's trying to say but what you're hearing is panic 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 yeah. panic when you're really working hard to calm yourself down yeah. the more kind of calmness you have in the environment of course that the, the easier it is yeah no i definitely think she would um like kind of understand it and like be a bit like calmer with me but yeah because because normally when we have these conversations we do it when we get to our limit of frustration and then we do yeah. it as an explosion and then it has the opposite effect yeah so the trick is to pick it at a moment where you're not reactive and she's not reactive and it's just a really carefully worded loving expression of of what of what you need yeah no that's definitely something that i have kind of thought about before but i've just not really got around to doing it yeah 